Yeah, good afternoon, everyone, and uh, warm welcome to all of you. So, myself, Shantanu Shirzat, and uh, today I will be giving you a brief about uh, Growbot as a company. Uh, what are the different products and solutions that we are offering for the Indian market, and towards the end, some of the installations with Growbot inverters. So, basically, Growbot was founded in the year 2010 with an USD capital of uh, 20 million dollars, and basically, Growbot is a new energy enterprise which is dedicated to R&D as well as manufacturing of on-grid inverters, storage solutions, off-grid inverters, and lately we have started with EV chargers also. Basically, Growot inverters are used in the application of uh, residential rooftop CNDI segment as well as utility. So talking about uh, the milestones, uh, founded in the year 2010, in the next subsequent year, that is 2011, Growot was the number one exporter of Sting inverters from China. In 2012, we became the number one inverter brand in China itself. In 2013, we came up with our subsidiaries in UK and various other countries globally. In 2015, we launched our first hybrid inverter uh, up to 10 kilowatt for the residential segment. In 2016 and onwards, we are still the number one inverter brand for the residential segment in China. In 2017, we exceeded a global shipment of 1 million units, which aggregated to more than around 10 gigawatt of supply of inverters worldwide. Uh, in 2018, uh, we became the number one inverter brand in the residential segment uh, globally. And uh, in the, it is the same year in which we also launched our off-grid inverters. In 2020, we came up with a new manufacturing facility in China, where we have ramped up our uh, uh, overall production up to 20 gigawatt. By the end of year 2021, we have shipped more than 40 gigawatt of uh, inverters worldwide, which aggregates to around 3.8 million units, which is highest in the market right now. So talking about the growth that we have achieved in the last couple of uh, years, in uh, 2020, we did a cumulative business of uh, 300 uh, million USD. And in 2021, uh, we did more than 500 million USD of uh, business. And every year we are targeting a growth of more than 50%. As I have already mentioned, globally, uh, we have shipped more than 3.8 million units, which aggregates to supply of 40 gigawatt of inverters, ranging from 1 kilowatt onwards up to 255 kilowatt. We are having our presence in more than 100 countries globally. And we are a team of more than 3,000 employees, out of which 600 are employed dedicatedly only for the R&D purpose. For the uh, rooftop segment in India, we are ranking number one for the last three years. And if you are talking about the global shipment uh, in the distributed PV segment, then for most of the countries worldwide, we are ranking in top three positions. Like for example, Italy, Mexico, Brazil, Vietnam, uh, China itself. Uh, in China, we are having a market share of more than 35%. That is every third inverter that is sold in China is of Growot. For India also, we are having a market share of more than 18% if you are considering only the rooftop segment. In 2021, uh, as per the IHS market report, uh, Growot was ranking number one for the supply of inverters in supply of uh, residential inverters ranging up to uh, 6 kilowatt. And if you are talking about the CNDI segment, then Growot is ranking in top five uh, for the supply of uh, inverters uh, from 50 kilowatt onwards up to 100 and 25 kilowatt with a market share of more than 10%. Uh, for energy storage also, we are ranking uh, number two for the supply of inverters with a market share of more than 15%. Uh, in 2022, as per the U, uh, UPD Research Lab, uh, which is a German-based uh, company, uh, Growot has received 22 uh, awards for the top PV inverter brand for various countries, for the Latin American continent or for the Europe or as well as for the Asia. So cumulatively, we got 22 awards as a uh, top PV brand inverter. Uh, as uh, it is a uh, electronic uh, company, so the base or the heart of any electronic company lies in its R&D. So every year, Growot is spending more than 6% of its total sales revenue only for the R&D purpose. In the last five years, uh, from 2016 to 2021, Growot has uh, invested uh, more than $100 million only for the R&D purpose. That is a CAGR of around 20% per year. Growot is having more than 110 patents to its name, out of which 60 are Chinese patents, more than 30 we are having international patents, and more than 20 software copyrights. 
Also, GrowWatt's 20 kilowatt inverter, which was being tested by Photon Lab, has reached the maximum efficiency of 99.06%, which is again highest by any inverter brand. And this year itself, in uh, Solar Congress uh, 2022, GrowWatt's 125 kilowatt inverter, Max Series, has received the best commercial inverter award. Uh, in uh, China itself, uh, we have uh, set up a, a joint laboratory with uh, Texas Instruments, where we are carrying out uh, different uh, sustainable energy applications. Also, we have established a research center uh, for uh, national electric power conversion and control with China Ministry of Science and Technology. Uh, in 2020, as I mentioned, we have come up uh, with a new manufacturing facility where we have ramped up our production from 5 gigawatt up to 20 gigawatt. Along with that, we are also manufacturing uh, battery modules and the yearly capacity is of 4 lakh battery modules every year. It is a completely automated uh, factory where we are uh, following stringent uh, quality control with 5 steps quality system that are being done by GrowWatt. Uh, talking about the global presence, right now we are having 23 offices uh, worldwide and in India we are having two service centers in Hyderabad as well as in Ahmedabad. Talking about our uh, Indian presence, so right now we are a team of uh, more than 25 employees. We are having one Indian director and to support him we are having four sales persons along with two product managers. For the after sales support, uh, we are having more than 20 service engineers which are located at different cities in India. Uh, talking about the after sales support, we are having two uh, service centers uh, in Hyderabad as well as in Ahmedabad where cumulatively we are carrying a stock of more than 10 megawatt of uh, inverters for uh, after sales support as well as spare parts. Uh, this is our 10th year uh, in uh, Indian business and uh, in REI we will be celebrating our 10 uh, year presence in the Indian market. And till date for India itself, we have shipped more than 2.5 lakh units of inverter which is again highest by any inverter manufacturer for India, which cumulatively goes to more than 3 gigawatt of supply of inverters for the Indian market itself. Now coming on to the different solutions that uh, GrowWatt is offering for the Indian market, uh, starting on with the on-grid inverters. So basically these inverters are used for the residential rooftop CNDI as well as the utility segment. And if you're talking about the residential pro, uh, products, it is again differentiated into two different uh, uh, segments, single phase as well as three phase. In single phase, we are having a range starting from one kilowatt onwards up to six kilowatt. Whereas for uh, three phase, uh, we, uh, the range starts from three kilowatt onwards up to 15 kilowatt. GrowWatt three phase inverters are all provided with type two protections on AC as well as on DC side, starting from three kilowatt onwards. So again, uh, if you are talking about any sort of protection, so all the internal protections we are already providing in the inverter itself. Talking about the CNDI as well as the utility, the CNDI product range starts from 20 kilowatt onwards and goes up to 125 kilowatt. So the max uh, 125 kilowatt inverter is again the highest uh, uh, rating of inverter available in the market right now with 10 number of MPPTs. If you are talking about the uh, utility based uh, segment, we are having again two different uh, products. Uh, one is uh, 20, uh, 250 kilowatt and the second one is 255 kilowatt. The major difference uh, in both these inverters is of the number of MPPTs. 250 kilowatt comes with 12 number of MPPTs, whereas 253 kilowatt comes with 15 number of MPPTs. So again, the 253 kilowatt is again the only inverter available in the market with highest number of MPPTs. Uh, talking about the energy uh, storage, uh, so for this particular, uh, we are having a range of inverters which starts from 1 kilowatt onwards and can be extended up to 1.2 megawatt depending on the requirement of the end user. So here we will be giving you a glimpse about uh, the residential uh, energy storage uh, solutions that we are offering. Uh, again, we are having AC coupled as well as DC coupled or uh, we can say hybrid inverters. Uh, the AC coupled uh, again comes in single phase as well as three phase from three kilowatt onwards up to six kilowatt. And in three phase, uh, it starts from four kilowatt onwards up to 10 kilowatt. Uh, along with the inverters, we are also manufacturing the lithium ion uh, batteries, uh, which starts from 2.5 kWh and can be extended up to 50 kWh of battery system. Uh, recently, uh, for the European market, uh, we have launched uh, battery-ready uh, on-grid inverters. 
So basically these type of inverters can be normally used as an on-grid inverter and in near future if you want to go for any battery based so you don't need to go for any additional inverter. The same inverter is being provided with the provision of connecting the batteries and in near future after two or three years if you want to go for any sort of uh, battery based system then you just need to uh, connect the additional batteries and the same inverter can work as an on-grid inverter and whenever the grid is not available the same inverter can be utilized as an off-grid inverter also. So for the Indian market uh, mostly we'll be launching these uh, inverters in early next year but uh, uh, for the time being these inverters are majorly available for the European and Australian market. Uh, also, uh, if you're talking about the microgrid or the off-grid inverters, in single phase, we are having up to 5 kilowatt uh, inverter, which can be connected in parallel to uh, make up up to a 30 kilowatt of system. And in REI, we are coming up with our new off-grid and hybrid inverter up to 100 kilowatt. So this will be a, a new product that will be launching uh, during the REI. Uh, talking about the EV chargers, uh, uh, this year itself we have launched uh, uh, EV chargers, uh, AC chargers as well as uh, DC chargers. Uh, in single phase, uh, we are having the capacity of 3 kilowatt and 7 kilowatt. Whereas in three phase, we are having the capacity of EV chargers of 11 kilowatt as well as 22 kilowatt. If you are talking about fast DC chargers, then right now we are having 40 kilowatt of fast DC charger which, uh, which comes with a single gun or a dual gun. Uh, also, uh, we are having our own energy management uh, solution which is built upon the uh, artificial intelligence and the uh, IoT and which uh, helps to provide a proper solution to provide a clean energy for household as well as for the businesses. So for this purpose, we are having different uh, options available. So for the monitoring of uh, individual inverter, we are providing Wi-Fi based dongles, GPRS and lately we have also launched 4G dongles for individual inverter monitoring. Uh, if you are having any uh, CNDI or utility plant, then for that uh, we are having our own data logger by the name of uh, Shine Master, with which it is possible for you to connect up to 64 number of inverters. Uh, for utility uh, segment itself, uh, we have also launched our power line communication uh, system, with which uh, instead of uh, communicating through uh, traditional RS-485, all the data from the inverters can be uh, captured directly from the AC output, that is from the cable. So you are uh, reducing the overall uh, cabling, uh, communication cabling that is uh, required. Also, we are having our own portal where you can monitor your plant globally from anywhere just by uh, entering your username and password. And we have uh, our own application uh, for Google as well as for iPhone. Now coming on to the uh, last uh, segment, some of the global references. So this was one of the case study uh, for a customer in Australia where he has installed a 5 kilowatt inverter in the year 2010. And in 2020, he went on for the extension of his uh, solar power plant where he has gone with the new generation of uh, GrowWatt inverters. And uh, now you can say for the last uh, 12 years, uh, the inverter which was installed in 2010 is still working without any issues. This is a, a storage uh, installation in South Australia where we have uh, used our on-grid inverter and after that uh, he has gone for the battery storage system where he has gone for uh, AC coupled inverter. Uh, for Royal Thai Air Force for different uh, bases in Thailand we have provided our 100 kilowatt storage solution for uh, Royal Thai Air Force and uh, these uh, particular in uh, inverters are working without any issues for more than three years. Now this is some of the installations. In, this is one is in uh, Switzerland, 1.2 megawatt. Then a solar farm in Maldives with our max series uh, inverter and 30 kilowatt inverters. Again in Vietnam, one uh, three megawatt plant, a four megawatt uh, plant uh, in China, a five megawatt plant in Ukraine. This is a 5.5 megawatt by Kirloska uh, in uh, Kolhapur. Uh, this particular plant has already uh, crossed five years of its operation. Again, a 10 megawatt plant in uh, China. Uh, now, this is a 90 megawatt solar farm in uh, Thailand, uh, where we have provided 20 kilowatt inverters for a utility based project. The same scenario is with a 100 megawatt uh, Foxconn uh, solar farm, where 40 kilowatt inverters have been utilized. 
This is a 4 megawatt plant in uh, Hyderabad where uh, 200 numbers of 20 kilowatt were used. Uh, this is our first installation of Max series uh, back in 2019. Uh, again, a 500 kilowatt in IIT Hyderabad for Forbes Aurangabad, 1 megawatt. Uh, now this is a 7.5 megawatt plant in uh, Solapur where uh, we have uh, uh, given our max uh, 250, uh, 253 kilowatt inverter for utility in 1500 volts. Again a 10 megawatt plant in Zasi uh, with max 250 utility based inverter. Uh, for Sadhguru cement in MP uh, where uh, 60 kilowatt inverters were being used. And again, one uh, plant in Solapur, where 84 numbers of 60 kilowatt has been utilized. So uh, that's it from uh, my side. If you are having any issues regarding the inverters, uh, we can have a uh, chat off-site off also. So thank you. Thank you once again for your precious time.